Wow, you have taken down the blackberry. Tell me what you're doing here, Drew. Yeah, so the Himalayan blackberries were obviously super tall and had completely infested this whole area. And normally we see that as just an absolute problem, which unmanaged it is. But when you look at what's actually it's doing to the soil and the condition that's creating. So here's soil that's from the essentially cheatgrass pasture. And then this is the soil that just came off underneath the brambles. We have amazing soil. We have ground cover and fertility. I love Himalayan blackberries. There is no other species growing in our area that is this vigorous and this prolific that allows you to change the conditions from degraded pasture to forest within a couple years when managed properly. We like the demonized plants, which makes absolutely no sense because in an intact, healthy ecosystem, weeds don't exist because every role of the ecosystem is filled. When you have long-term abused soil that's compacted and disturbed and in pastures, when there's bare ground, blackberries, that's where they grow. So we can create the conditions for these invasive weeds, but then we blame the weeds as just a symptom of our management. If we work with the processes, I mean, we'll have four inches of mulch that we didn't have to bring in, that was literally grown in place that we'll use to our advantage to top the very thing that was the problem. So really the problem is the solution. Here's a red alder that started here. It has sprouted and it was just trying to get sunlight. Trees eventually break through this and they shade out the blackberries. We're gonna use nature's model. If there was a density of blackberries, we're gonna use it to our own advantage. Live from the living lab, the big development is we have finally tackled this Himalayan blackberry and we're gonna use it to compost. This is how nature begins to complexify and correct problems like compaction and nutrient deficiencies in the soil. We're gonna cut this all to the ground. It'll be mulch.